Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. Today I have some incredible news for you. Nintendo Switch emulation on Android just got a massive update. Let's get started. All right, to kick things off, we're talking about the best Nintendo Switch emulator on Android, Skyline. Skyline is 100% free. You can pick it up at skyline-emu.1. And Skyline just got a massive update that increases performance by a considerable margin. So once you're at skyline-emu.1, click on the download button, and then you'll want to pick up at least version 1289. At the time of filming, this is the most recent one. Now this new version of Skyline version 1289 has been completely overhauled. The developers have worked overtime to assemble this one and get it out. Now this version does officially bring about those custom GPU drivers. If you go into your settings menu and scroll down to where you see GPU driver configuration, you can upload custom GPU drivers. There are a bunch of different drivers available and this is extremely useful if you have a Snapdragon processor. If you wanna learn more, I have done a video on how to install these and set them up and I'll leave it in the description below. Or you can head to the Skyline Discord where you can actually get those files. In fact, as of this video, Turnip V8 and Turnip V10 drivers are available on their Discord, and I'll drop a link to that in the description below. Now, in addition to that, there's also been a massive performance improvement. Rayman here is running at 60 frames a second. Attack on Titan 2 is up and running at about 15 frames a second. In fact, someone got it up to over 20 frames a second. Arguably kind of playable. One Piece Unlimited World Red is up and running at 62 frames a second. Super Mario Odyssey is running faster, up to close to 60 frames a second. Yes, the graphics are still a little bit broken, but they will get better in time. And this is on a Snapdragon 865. Here's Super Mario Odyssey on a Snapdragon 870. Nice and smooth, but it does end up crashing. Hollow Knight is up to 80 frames a second on a Google Pixel 3. Here's Hollow Knight running at 60 frames a second on a Snapdragon 750G. Shantae's Risky Revenge is at 60 frames a second, playable in-game. My friend Pedro's running over 40 frames a second, at some points over 50 frames a second on a Poco X3 Pro. Undernight Inbirth is running at 60 frames a second. Celeste is at 60 frames a second on a Snapdragon 662. And this one is huge. Breath of the Wild is now in game. And this is it up and running on a Google Pixel 3. And just to level set here, Breath of the Wild getting in game does not mean Breath of the Wild fully playable. It's still gonna be a while, but they are making incredible progress. Now, what I just showed you was pretty much a small slice as to the entire list of games that have been improved. There's been improvements basically across the entire board. Skyline has been revamped by a very big margin. I mean, there were over 70 commits in this latest update. The developers have been working extremely hard on this stuff. In fact, one of the main developers for Skyline, Mark, will be taking a very small break. This does not mean Skyline is dead. This does not mean Skyline is slowing down at all. One of the developers is just taking a break after working on it nonstop. The other developers are sticking around and we're still gonna be seeing a lot of updates and fixes in the near future. And if for some reason you're very worried about this, Mark says, I have no plans to leave Skyline and I don't see any disruptions in the speed of development after I'm back from my break. In my opinion, I think Mark has deserved a little bit of a vacation here. This update is massive. I'm extremely excited about Skyline. It's improved in leaps and bounds. Anyways, that is all I've got for you in this one. Straight to the point. All stuff and no fluff. Let me know your thoughts about this brand new version of Skyline in the comments below. Have you tried it out? What are your thoughts about it? And if you haven't tried it out, are you going to check it out? Let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button. Check out my other videos. Don't tempt fate. Save your state.